Welcome everyone. It is the season of pumpkin spice and with that comes pumpkin beers. I know, I know, I know. We've all been there where it's like, ooh, pumpkin beers. They're not good. I don't like them. I don't want to taste them. And back in the day, I was the same way. Pumpkin beers have come a long way. It's 2022 now and we have found, I've been testing many, many pumpkin beers to find my top three pumpkin beers. As some would say, pumpkin beers that don't suck. These are actually really good pumpkin beers. Let's check each one out. First up, we got Pumpkin. This has been one of my favorites for a few years now from Southern Tier Brewing Company. Next up, this is Rogue Pumpkin Patch Ale. And finally, New Belgium. This is the Spicy Atomic Pumpkin. Let's pour these in here and taste them right now to see why we like them. All right, first up, you come in here to watch the pour. We got our Southern Tier Pumpkin. It's like pumpkin pie in a glass. We'll get them all stationed down here real quick. All right, here's the pumpkin patch ale. This is the one that impressed me the most this year. And I say that because they use real pumpkins in the brewing process. It's not just about spices. Let's read this. Pumpkin patch ale is made with whole pumpkins that we chop up and roast by hand. We'll taste it here in a second, but let me tell you, it's amazing. I think it's because they use real pumpkins in there. So you can check out our color so far. Very similar with the pumpkin. And last, this is the New Belgium. This is the Atomic. So this is the one that's got pumpkin, but a little bit of spice. So something a little bit different. At first I was like, I don't think I'm gonna like this one, but I was pleasantly surprised by this one from New Belgium. All right, first up, Pumpkin. This has been one of my favorite pumpkin beers for years. It's the booziest out of these, I believe. Let's see, we got 8.6 ABV. So again, it's got a little bit higher ABV than some of the other pumpkin beers that I've tested. And you can taste it. It does taste like a little more alcohol in here, but the pumpkin and just the character behind this makes it one of my all time favorites. Next up, this is New Kid on the Block as we talked about. Let's see what we got on this one. This one is 6.1% alcohol. Again, with the real whole pumpkins in there. Now you can smell, like the pumpkin smell on this one is probably the best nose of any of these. Like, it's, it's so clean and smooth. Like you don't really taste, like th this one over here, you taste alcohol a little bit more. This one's really smooth, so it could sneak up on you. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. All right, last but not least, the Spicy Atomic Pumpkin from New Belgium. You say this has got the clearest pour of all these so far. It almost, it almost has a touch of spice in there. You don't smell the pumpkin as much in there like the glass ones. But there's pumpkin and there's just a little bit of spice. It's not, I'm not a real spicy guy, but this has just a little bit and there's something about it that's pretty addictive for us. I've bought a few six packs of these so far this Halloween season as well too. So again, these are my top three pumpkin flavored beers. Of course, there are other ones out there that are pretty good. These are the ones I feel confident that even if somebody that doesn't like pumpkin beer, one of these, you're gonna find something because each one's a little bit different with the pumpkin and the character that it brings. I'm Luca Tailgating Challenge. I love testing out tailgating products and unique beers, of course, off social media because we test stuff and we do giveaways every single week. Drop us a comment. I wanna know what is your go-to pumpkin beer because if I haven't tried it, I probably need to try it. Until next time, cheers to pumpkin beer.